This is Professor Davenport the Pug, reporting on Pug University with The Craven by Edgar Allan Pug, Part 5. But the snack, still beguiling, old Pug's fancy into smiling. Straight Pug wheeled a cushioned seat in front of snack and bust and door. Then upon the velvet sinking, Pug betook itself to linking, fancy onto fancy, thinking, what this ominous snack of yore, what this grim, ungainly, ghastly, gaunt, and ominous snack of yore, meant in croaking, nevermore. Then Pug thought the air grew denser, perfumed from an unseen censer, swung by seraphim, whose footfalls tinkled on the tufted floor. Wretch, Pug cried, thy God hath lent thee, by these angels he hath sent thee, respite, respite, and nepenthe, from memories of convenience store. Quaff, oh, quaff, this kind nepenthe, and forget convenience store, quoth the snack, nevermore.